Hi everyone, today we're going to review how to add two three-digit numbers. Okay, so we're going to be using this equation here today to help us review adding two three-digit numbers. And this equation says 367 plus 245 equals something. And this is the answer that we're looking for. So our first step when we're adding three-digit numbers is to break each one of the add-ins apart by place value. So I'm going to start here with this first add-in, which is 367, and I'm going to start with the hundreds place. And so I know here that the three in this hundreds place is telling me that there are three groups of 100. So three groups of 100 is 300. So in my hundreds place, I have a 300. Now I'm going to move to my tens place. And this six is in my tens place. And so it is telling me that I have six groups of 10. And I know that six groups of 10 is 60. And now I'm going to move oops, to my ones place. And I know that the ones are telling me how many groups of one I have. And so this is telling me I have seven groups of one or seven. So here I've broken apart this first addend by place value. Now I can move to my second addend, 245. And so I'll start again at my hundreds place. And I know that this two is telling me I have two groups of 100. And two groups of 100 is 200. And so I can move now to my tens place. This four is in my tens place. And it's telling me I have four groups of 10. Four groups of 10 is 40. So now that I have my hundreds and my tens, I can move to my ones. And this five is telling me that I have five groups of one. Five groups of one is a five. So now I've separated both add-ins by place value. I've broken them apart. Now that I have these two numbers broken apart, I can start adding the place values together. So I can add the hundreds with the hundreds, the tens with the tens, and the ones with the ones. So I'll start with my hundreds places, and I'm going to write here an H for hundreds, and I'm going to take this 300, 300 plus, and I'm going to take this 200, 200 equals something. So now I'm going to add these together, and I know that 300 plus 200 is 500. So now, I've added my hundreds together, and I'm ready to move on to my tens place. So I'm gonna take this 60 and this 40 and add them together. So I have a T for tens, and I'm gonna take 60, oops, 60 plus, 40 equals something. And if I remember my number bonds, I see the number 60 and the number 40, and I know that 60 plus 40 is 100. So I add here, 60 plus 40 equals 100. Now that I've finished with my tens place, I can move to my ones place. So I'm gonna write an O here for ones, 
And I'm going to take this 7 plus this 5. And that equals something. So now in my mind, I add 7 plus 5. And I write the answer on the line. So now that I've added together my place values, I'm not done yet. To find the total, I now have to add these answers together. So I'm going to add my answer from the hundreds plus the answer from the tens plus the answer from the ones to find my total answer. So I'm going to write an A for answer. And to find this answer, I'm going to take this 500 and write it here. Plus this 100 and write it here. Plus this 12 and write it right here. And so 500 plus 100 plus 12 is going to give me my final answer. And so I'll add up 500 plus 100, that's 600, and 600 plus 12 is 612. So now I have my answer here, and I'm going to write it in my original equation. So 367 plus 245 equals 612. And there we have it. We just reviewed how to add two three-digit numbers. I hope this helped.